here tonight in the Savoy in Dublin for the closing film of the Jemison Dublin International Film Festival, The Secret of Kells. And we're going to be talking to the stars Brendan Gleeson, Mick Lally and many more. Uh, how great is it that your film is closing the film festival? We're really excited. It was such a great thrill, and especially for Grania to give us this slot. We're really excited. And how did it, was it working with Brendan and Mick and then Evan and Christine? Oh, it was just brilliant. Uh, Evan and Christine were just totally professional. And of course, Mick and Brendan, it was just totally easy. It was pure prose. It was great. And have you got any other projects that are lined up now that you're working on? Oh yeah, we're working on a new project called Song of the Sea. It's about the last little Selkie child making her way back to the sea. How exciting is this? This is your first premiere. So exciting. It's such a great achievement. And how did you two get on? I mean, you became the best friends, Brendan and Ashling, together. So how was it working with each other? Because it's your first film, really, isn't it? It was great fun. Like, uh, It wasn't like really as hectic as you think it was. It's in, like the recording studio. It's great crack like with Brendan Gleeson and everything. So you got to meet Brendan Gleeson? Well, I did. Un unfortunately, Kirsten didn't. Uh, I had a few scenes with him, and like we kicked the ball around sometimes in the studio, so it was like the best one. And how did you get involved in acting? It, uh, it was my. Uh, I was with Trading Faces in Galway, Claire Power, and she set me up with the movie. So I did a few auditions, and they decided to pick my voice. And how did you get involved in acting? Uh, well, I'm in the Billy Ray Stage School with Lorraine Barry, and she had sent me for it, and that's why I got I it. love your little outfit. Can we get a shot of her outfit here? Absolutely stunning, and your shoes are gorgeous. Okay, well, thanks a million, guys. Uh, Jack L, you're talking to entertainment.ie. How, how are, are you? you? How are you? Are you looking forward to seeing The Secret of Kells? I'm really looking forward to it, actually, yeah. I don't know too much about it, but uh, I'm interested. In it is story. an absolutely beautiful story. Well, judging by the posters and the reports I've heard, it sounds fascinating and it's, it's great to see because we have so much folklore and stuff. You know, you got the Lord of the Rings and stuff, but we actually have it for real, so we should really be... Uh... Because it's actually been a very long time since we have made a film based on the Irish history, mm. you know, and it is a great tale yeah, to tell yeah. the children. It's endless as regards uh, the amount of material that's there to do with it, so hopefully this will be the first of many. Welcome to the closing uh, film of the film festival. How are you? Are you looking forward to seeing the film? I'm actually dying to see the film. I was in Berlin and they were, um, they, the Irish Film Board were out there um, showing it a few times, so I, I unfortunately missed it, but I'm very excited to see it out here. It's an absolutely beautiful story, so you won't be let down. Brendan plays a blinder and so does Evan and Christine. Do you have any advice for any young people that want to get into acting, what they should do to you know, progress their career a little bit? Well, obviously, um, I mean, I think I went to um, Anne Kavanagh's Drama School for a couple of years, which not gets you into the industry, but just builds up your confidence. I feel like you're just put in front of a camera a lot and just told to, to given a few directions, so you just need the confidence to get up there and give it your all. I know from experience, Anne Kavanagh does not take any prisoners because she taught me speech and drama <laughs> as well. So she is a great teacher to have. And um, what else did you kind of do just to start yourself off? Well, I mean, honestly, I was very lucky. I mean, I was thrown into it all with Jim Sheridan's, um, with Jim Sheridan and In America. So, I mean, I was very lucky. It was just sort of one movie onto another. I mean, auditions are difficult. I would say do a lot of research if, um, if you get the opportunity. And I, um, other than that, I think it's all down to luck. Um, you played Brother Aiden, and he was... If you say so. <laughs> <laughs> it's so long ago, I have, no, I have no idea what I did in it. Yeah. Well, you struck up a friendship with uh, Brendan, and, you know, you kind of taught him everything about the heritage and the Irish and the Book of Kells. How important do you think that is? Four children to learn about nowadays because it can often be forgotten. Oh, it would be fairly important, you know. It's uh, you know anything that kids now nowadays learn about any portion of our heritage, uh, even even since the Book of Kells, you know. It's you know it's, it has it is important. And did you enjoy working with Tom and Nora from Cartoon Saloon? Well, I, well, you see, it was only a few days, you know, and um, it's so long ago I can't remember, you know, because. So much as you know, because you, you, you do so much in the meantime, that's you, 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 you know, because your your brain does displace things as they become unnecessary. <laughs> you know, so I can't remember exactly when I did it. And whenever it was about three years ago, I think. Oh, three years ago, is that it? Oh, it's a good while ago. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And yeah. when you were recording, did you and Brandon ever go into the same booth, or did you do everything separately? Uh, I think most was done separately. I think. Yeah, I think it was. Yeah. yeah. And are you working on anything new at the moment? Not or are you the taking moment, a break? No, no. No. You're on holidays. I'm an idol. idol. Straight from the IFTAs, how was this being at the awards? Because last year you weren't able to collect your awards, but this time you were. 
No, I wasn't. It was brilliant. Um, I got to meet some great people and I'm really delighted that I got to go up on stage and I got to, you know, thank everyone for the movie. So. And your dress was fabulous. Where did you get your dress from? Lee Tucker. Very nice. And are you working on anything new at the moment that you can tell us about? Um, I'm working on a movie called The Way Back. We're starting shooting on that next month. So. Yeah. And are you looking forward to seeing The Secret of Kells? It's an absolutely beautiful story. Do you know much about it? I actually don't, no. Um, see, I, I opened the Dublin Film Festival a few weeks ago and I was so busy and I wasn't able to see any of the other movies so I really wanted to see one and I thought, well, why not a children's movie? So. OK, well, enjoy the film and thanks, Emil, for Thank talking you. to us. Thanks again. Hi, Brendan. An absolute right. pleasure to meet you. You're talking to entertainment.ie. So you played a brother Calic, he was the abbot of Kells and yeah. you were um, Brendan's uncle. How did you put your own stamp on the role? Did you kind of, from being a teacher a number of years ago, was, yeah, it was very was a little bit about that, <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I mean, you know, everybody goes by their own light. So, um, I mean, it's such a long time ago now. That's the other thing. I'm kind of, I'm struggling even to. I just remember having fun in the studio, fundamentally. So I think we went in, and uh, I, was, I was more or less guided by the lads. And this, you know, you, you haven't done a film like this in a number of years because it was in Bruges beforehand mm. and you've done, like, everybody knows you from The General, right. which was unbelievable. But this is an animation, so how did it kind of differ? I mean, because you were in a booth, really, yeah. recording. Well, I mean, it's a, it's a touch like a radio play, in, in a sense. And uh, I was kind of a, a little bit stunned at how quickly the whole thing happened. Like, we, we did, I did a shooting in a couple of hours, really. Um, and... Uh, they film it then and, and so they think they can take expressions if they need them or, or, or get better ones if they need them. And how are you approached for the role? Um, I met Paul. Paul just came, approached me at, um, I think it was a screening or something. I can't remember where, maybe, maybe it was at Dublin Film Festival, but I can't remember. Um, I must ask him again now. And uh, he, I just was really impressed with the way he went at it. You know, he, he wasn't looking for anything. He just wondered if I'd be interested in... And uh, it sounded fascinating, so he just sent me then more stuff, and there was a really can-do kind of attitude from him, so I was delighted to be involved. So we might see you yet again in another animated film? Oh, I hope so. Let's hope so.